Hey YouTube, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a lip swatch video. As promised, I am going to be swatching the Sephora Midnight Kisses Lip Stories lipsticks that is part of their holiday collection. There are six lipsticks in here. Five of them are matte and one of them is a metallic lipstick. The one that I have on now, which I'm going to re-swatch, is called... Um, it's on the side, sorry. It's called Wanderlust, and that is this one here that has the cup of hot chocolate with the marshmallows in it. It is looking shiny right now, I am assuming, because it's supposed to be a matte. I have under it the Fenty Gloss Balm, so I think that's making it look a little bit shiny. Um, the price of this collection, and I have to look it up. The price of this collection um, normally is $28. I am seeing that it is on sale for $19 on Sephora.com. Today is November the 25th. So I am not sure by the time I put this video up, it's going to be Thursday, almost like the, it's going to be like the 29th of December. Um, so today is 19. Thursday it might be back up to 28 I am not sure but anyway as promised I am going to do swatches I am going to take what I have on my lips off now this is going to be pretty much torture because I forgot to bring a lip balm down here but I want to show you truly what the um the lip colors look like and we want to make sure that that gloss balm is not making something that's matte appear to be a shiny lipstick so I have wiped that one off and that one is the darkest one I am going to start with the nude color in it and this one is called landing in Shanghai and it looks like this it has the clock on the front of it this one it's actually a cream so I lied not all of them are matte or um, not all of them are matte or metallic. This one is actually a cream lipstick. And as you can see, it is a very nude lipstick. I probably should have saved this one because this is probably the one that's going to save my lips. This one looks wretched on my lips right now oh, I wish I would have brought a brown lip liner I am going to go get a brown lip liner so that I can show you what this looks like once it is corrected all right so I have grabbed my chestnut lip liner which is my answer to everything and we will see what that looks like a little pale for my liking but the chestnut lip liner definitely does something for it let's see if we can sort of mm -hmm. if you do it the right way um the only thing I don't like is this here, the, around the lip thing here. But if you do it the right way, that one can be wearable. So this one that I have on now is called Landing in Shanghai. All right, so the next one that I am going to try on is called Festival Lights. And it has the lights all around it. And this is the one that is the hashtag metal lipstick. So it looks like this. And I have high hopes for this one. Yeah, this one is pretty. I can kind of feel a little bit of a grit.
Yeah, I can feel a little wow. This one is definitely a metal lipstick. Um, let's try chestnut again because chestnut fixes everything. Yes, that is super pretty. I like that one. This one is definitely not your everyday, but it is still pretty. So this one is the Festival Lights. Does not go with my eye makeup at all, but I still like it. All right, that Festival Light left a little bit of glitter, but the next one that we are going to try is called Celebrates and it is a bright pink. This one is also a matte formula. This also looks a little light. This one I would not do with chestnut for sure. Oh, that's pretty though. What I do like about the matte formula so far, it's not a true matte but it is comfortable. It is a very comfortable lipstick. So it's not making my lips feel like they're dried out when I put it on there. Wow, this is definitely celebrate. That is pretty. Uh, we're gonna dig in the makeup bag here and I am going to, let's see what we can grab here. Let's do, Magenta might be a little bit too light for what I'm going for. Let's go, not Night Mall. I had a current lip liner and I, for the life of me, don't know what happened to my current lip liner. Um, let's go with Be Spoken For. I think that's as close to current as I'm going to get today. Trying to take that obvious. Okay, my, my lip swatches are not going to be perfect because they're just not. Who has time for that? But I didn't want that obvious um, lip line, but this one is okay. This one is okay. I need to go get me a current lip liner for sure. But I kind of like Celebrate. It's a bright pink and it's like the outside of the comfort zone pink. But I like it. So this one, once again, is Celebrate. All right, three down, three to go. The lips are starting to get stained. Um, but the rest of them are like berry and red color. So the next one that I am going to be trying on for you has this cute little sled on the front. And this one is called Golden Gate. I feel like this is a color that I have, like this is like a regular color, but they just repackaged it for the holiday. I feel like I have this color already. For some reason, I cannot locate it, but I do think I have it. So this one is Golden Gate. This is pretty. Oh, and this one is a matte also, but it feels so smooth on. It feels so smooth going on. My lips are starting to feel like they're taking a beating. And this lip swatch is whack. But I like the lip color. I would probably put a gloss on top of this one and make it like super glossy. I like the way this one looks with my um, eyeshadow as well. And this one once again is Golden Gate. All right, so the next one that I am going to show you is a classic red, and this one is called A Little Magic. And a little bit of red lipstick can definitely be a little magic. This one is also matte, and it looks like that. So we have 
four mattes, one cream, and one metallic lipstick in this collection. So I correct myself from before. And let us, oh, I already like it. This is definitely a pretty holiday red color. Mm. Um, yes. My lip swatch is horrible. I'll kind of clean that up just a little bit with my concealer. That is definitely a little magic. Let's put a little bit more of this right in the center. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. I love this color right here. A little magic, and it has all of the little kisses all over it. So I like this one. This one is not bad with my um, eyeshadow either. So I really, really like this one. So five down and one more to swatch. All right, so now I'm going to re-swatch the one that I had on when I first started the video. And this is the one with the hot chocolate on it with the uh, marshmallows. And this one is called Wanderlust. I'm re-swatching this one because I had a gloss on when I first tried this on. So it was looking a little shiny. Mm. I really like this one. My swatch is absolutely horrible. Let's see if we can. This one is a good vampy fall color. Yes, I like this one. I like this one with the shadow that I have on. Um, it is definitely not coming across as a complete matte, but I'm okay with that because it will not make my lips feel dry, which my lips have already taken a beating from trying all of these on. It is very comfortable on the lips. So this is the collection. Once again, like I said, it is on sale for, let's make them all pretty. Let's put all the pictures in the front. Um, it is on sale for Nineteen dollars. Um, it's on sale for nineteen dollars on Sephora.com. If you would like to pick it up, I think that is very affordable, and I think this one will make an excellent gift for like the lipstick lover that you have in your family. Pick it up now, stash it away until Christmas. Thank you all so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. Please give me a thumbs up for trying on six different lip colors because my lips are battered right now, even though I have done more before. Um, if you are already subscribed to my channel, please make sure you hit that notification bell so you know when I have a new video coming out. Have a great day and may your day be as flawless as your makeup. Bye.